Hey, 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 happy every day. Sharon Horn Elves from here. Day 199 of doing one thing every day that makes me happy from the little journal book. Do one thing every day that makes me happy. I just got a kick out of this uh, filter today. It looks really good with my ponytail hanging out of the cowboy hat, right? But the beard and, you know, the nice beard mustache that's that just did it for me I'm like I didn't know that it said yellow so at the bottom but that just makes it all the funnier so today day 199 of doing one thing every day that makes us happy I decided that this year I had to focus on feeling better feeling good things that make me happy and what better way to do that than to go along with a little journal book and document every single day something that I actually notice and pay attention to something that makes me feel happy because Good things and bad things happen every day in our lives. It's what we pay attention to. It's what we notice and give our conscious attention to that we're going to get more of. And I want more happiness and more good things happening in my life. So today is one of those double sayings days where yesterday we talked about the first part of it. Today we're going to talk about the second part of it. Let's see what it has for us today. It says, handy dandy magnifying glass. The highlights of my life have been innumerable. But I think the real highlight is the persistent feeling that the best is yet to come. This was said by Mort Schindler. And our challenge today says, what I hope is yet to come. What am I looking forward to? What are you looking forward to? What do you hope your future will hold? What do you hope today will hold? What do you hope is going to happen today? What, do you, what are you going to make happen today, tomorrow, and in your future? Um. I, there's a couple of words that trip me up a little bit. The word try, the word hope. And most people love the word hope. The word hope to me feels weak. It feels like, oh, I hope something happens. I'll try to do it. And I ascribe to the theory that we make things happen. We choose to have things happen. We commit to making things happen. We commit to change. We commit to whatever it is that we want. And then we go after it. We don't just hope, oh, I hope I get that promotion. Wouldn't it be nice if so-and-so called me. I'll try to get that project done on time. Eh, no. The best is yet to come. So I'm really curious today because I've gone through phases in my life where I've just been content and kind of floated along and thought, you know, I guess this is all there is. This is what my life has to hold. This is as good as it's going to get. And those phases don't last very long with me. I don't stay complacent or in the status quo very much. I embrace change and I'm like, yeah, this is nice. This is fine, but I can get better. I can improve. There's more out there for me and those I love and care about. So then I'm going to go after something new. So what do you think? Do you think that your best days are behind you? Or do you honestly believe the best is yet to come? I would love to see you comment below and let me know what you're thinking, what you're feeling right now in this part of your life. And nothing is either good or bad, right or wrong. It's just how you're feeling right now. Do you feel like you've lived your best days? I'm 59 years old and I'm sure a lot of people think, hey man, you're old, your life is over. Your best is not yet to come. If you haven't done it already, it ain't happening. But I believe that we are continuously improving, ever expanding, continuously growing human always changing human beings and we can be and do and have whatever we want but we have to know what we want and we have to go after we have to want to have cool masks and look like a guy look like a cute cowboy or a cute i don't know what i would be desperado where's my my six shooters <laughs> anyway if you're just listening to the podcast you probably think i'm crazy but i've actually got a, a filter on today that's got a cowboy hat and a beard and a mustache are very well groomed beard and mustache kind of a goatee thing going on which is actually pretty funny I, I make an interesting looking guy so what do you hope is in your future what do you want to be in your future and what are you going to go for in your future to show and prove to yourself every single day that the best is yet to come even if you're struggling and having a hard time right now I'm moving right now and it absolutely positively stinks it is so much work it's so ridiculous it is so crazy and frustrating and overwhelming sometimes yet i know that moving is a really good thing and the best is yet to come so i will of course be with you tomorrow have an absolutely happy amazing day take care bye i want to say giddy up <laughs>